Hello there everyone and welcome back to Wolfenstein 2, the new Colossus. As we go back, because we still have Parade of Chronicles to do. So last time we finished Gunslinger Joe's, but we missed one gold. Cause I, I forgot I misplaced where the thing actually was. So yeah. Uh, uh, I'm just not gonna worry about it because it mostly just gives you story concept art, I guess. But yeah. So we would go into the diaries of Agent Silent Death, and Volume One, the Gestapo, Gestapo. Office. My word! Look at that handsome bloke, OSA secret agent Jack Valiant, super spy for the British Empire. The Queen's greatest asset. Except for one other. Agent Silent Death. My name is Jessica Valiant. During the war, I helped my husband perform his duties behind the scenes. Inseparable, both on the job and off until 1946. Jack bought me time to escape. If I'd had a choice, it would have been the other way around. Funny that, after the love of my life was taken away from me, the world submitted to the Nazis, and my faith in humanity crumbled. I fled to Brazil, choosing a life in anonymity. It was a simpler life. A steady flow of fine alcohol and charming strangers served as my medication. Kept me afloat without purpose or direction. Then one day, I received a mysterious folder with the image of a crimson bulldog imprinted on it. Inside were the briefs for three assassination targets. Torture expert, Uber Commander Hahn Stiglitz, Hollywood Nazi collaborator Chuck Lorenz, and the infamous General Gerhard Dunkel. What I read shook me to the core. The files provided evidence implicating these men as responsible for the betrayal, torture, and murder of my husband. These men had to die, and so I departed for California in the American territories. First on the list was Uber Commander Hans, the man who tortured Jack. Yep, the uh, whole demo. Thing. I'd spent the past years in a delightful blur of drinking and debauchery. But killing Nazis was like riding a bike. Oh, a dozen slit throats later, I found myself inside the Gestapo office in Sacramento, California. From there, I had to find my way to Uber Commander Hans's office at the top floor. But, but yeah. It's like, okay, the demo thing was like, it's all about finding that one guy. And then we didn't find that one guy. All we found was the paper that said go or he was over here instead. Anyway, so General Tonka restores over to California. He's on a price right to be able to conduct with Mr. Wolf Manor. Said General Tonka yesterday during live transmission from the moon. With a cold face of posture and a warm smile on his lips, the general explained how the anti-paid behavior of degenerate terrorists would not cause any security problems for the recent approach of the American territories. We protect you from these monsters, my fellow citizens of the Greater Reich. To the generous still the general issued some words of caution. These murderous individuals could be hiding anywhere. To make sure to inform the authorities of any criminal activity in your community, he added. <sighs> ah, just checking, making sure there's no fucking gold here at the start. Ah, yeah, the story knives. Oh, yeah, we should probably look at our stuff. Because Silent Death is a different character than Gunslinger Joe. She, her regular movement is completely silent and jumping is very much less noise. She also can go underneath vents that don't look like she should be able to. It almost looks like her head gets sort of gli clips a bit with the ceiling of those vents, but yeah, that's a thing. Also, power boost when killing an enemy, throw some time when in a weapon wheel, and we should freeze and horror behind player. So, Stealth takedowns, headshot kills, throw knife kills, 
killing enemies while in prone, which is basically that whole crawling thing. Also, quick commander kills. So basically, just everything's related to stealth, and I am all here for it. Like, I am totally all here for it. More so than I was with that. Also, by the way, Pesto has a suppressor. Because, of course, it does. Do I have a map of the place? No. Even if we had a map of the place, it wouldn't show me where the gold is, sadly. Okay. So, all heal for the head. Yeah, because her special thing is she could just go. She could go crouch, crouch. <coughs> like, as I said, crouch. Here's your intense training. The problem though is. Wissen Sie, wie wichtig es ist, dass wir diesen jämmerlichen Aufstand in Kalifornien unterdrücken? Wissen Sie, wie viel... So, I'm, I'm sorry. Just... I was gonna say, isn't that a technical problem, Kill? Yes, it is. Zeit und Mühe über Kommandant Hans in diese Aufgabe gesteckt hat. Wissen Sie, wie ablenkend es... Ah. Männer, ich bin in meinem Büro und bereite wichtige Dokumente für General Dunkel vor. Achten Sie really auf verdächtige right, terroristische Aktivitäten. Und bringt mir bitte eine Tasse Tee und ein Schinkenbrötchen. Okay. Heil Hitler. Uber Commander Hans was my first hit in years. That doesn't tell me much. Felt like problem. a stiff drink to take the edge off, but I had to stay focused. Oh, we could do this. The problem though is... Yeah, we're hiding under this desk. The problem is I can't actually... Well, maybe I can knife throw. Nope, can't even knife throw. I have to literally be right next to you. Or you're about to be able to assassinate like that. Dura, keine Bewegung! But you don't know where I'm at. Nope, you don't know where I'm at. You totally don't know where I'm at. I am hidden. Sneaky things. Well, those you assholes are gonna all stay up, though. Not come down here. He's still around. He's still. I was gonna say I need prone kill, so thanks for that. And I just keep going though, prone. Eh. Didn't really, didn't really go that well. Okay. Prone those, I think there's still ones active. Hi. You wanna come downstairs? Come on, you know you wanna come downstairs. I will literally wait you out if I have to. But you know you want to come downstairs. Don't know how I got some Bobby on a fucking pillar anyway. Well, the enemies are all just lying out here dead because, you know, for stealth, we don't know how to move bodies. No, not like the typical stealth mechanics really work. Oh, that was where is this fucker going? I don't know. He's disappeared somewhere again. It's very concerning because he's literally just up. The fuck has he gone? No, seriously. Where has that one gone to? Stop! Keine Bewegung! Ah! 
I mean, it's not a stair curl, but it's still technically a hitch. Take it. And let's go to my whole. Damn, she's not bad sprint. Paul notices sprint makes noise. Less noise, but still noise. Paul knows where is gold. I have to, you know, I have to check with the code. Cause of course I do. Ah, the notes, yes. Dear Hans, will you come back to the... Farland... Yeah, Farland to the... This is your dear old sister Sue and I miss you and you're funny jokes about Papa's bird watching obsession. Being a pop, he's doing sixty soon, so maybe that would be enough to give you an excuse for some time off work. But so he's found a great spot in the woods where we can go camping just like old times. Hope to see you soon, love, Lot. Lottie. Oh, more knives. I could use more knives. Knives are always good. Knives are always good. You can eat them at everyone. You can double stuff. Any gold? No. Well, that was overcharged. Ah, there's gold. Ah. Hmm. Anyway, so yeah. That's one gold. Do we have to look that one up? So yeah, we'll just keep... We could work on knives though, but yeah, for, I think we're mostly gonna work on those. My knife throw could be fun and all that, but it's so long as we get silent takedowns and we hide under shit, so Medicare Solid style, we should be fine. Yeah, I like the concept of stealth. Boards, I need more bullets. More pistol bullets. Because level guns aren't silent, which is. eh. eh. We could do our best, but that's stupid. I mean, I would prefer having the aim after all. Cause yeah, we could do it. What was that sound? That sound was me fucking up. But my girl there are someone over though. <laughs> that sound was me fucking up. So I could technically go that way. Or we could go did no one come to investigate? Probably no one came to investigate this entire time. Okay. This is like a dark room. That's somehow no. You're not supposed to know I'm hell. Yes, 
You asshole. Anyway, let's try that again this time. That's terrible. Let's go this way without alerting people. And then my nose is a dog. Oh shit. Please tell me they're not all this. Oh my god, they are. Stupid. How do they please tell me they're not all this stupid? They are all this stupid. Oh, that's awkward. That is really awkward. This is a good way to farm pro kills. I might have mounted out prone kills. <laughs> that was super fast while in that mode. So much for stealth, though. Well, that's gold, clearly. Hey, so I didn't miss any gold. Yeah, eat the dog food. Try hell from a dog food? Jeez. That's a lot. Crawling through those vents, I did regret one thing. Not diving into the hotel minibar the night before. That's our knives. Ah, huh, well, let's see if there's any notes of interest still. Stefan, do you always have to leave your dirty dishes on the table after you're discussing a milk food all the time? Who will calm down to Hans hates bad table manners and will surely you deal with harsh punishment when he finds out. And you don't want to be locked inside the interrogation room with him, do you? So, apparently they're talking about me, Agent Silent Death. I don't have to worry about the overcharge health or any of that. I just have to focus on, you know, stabbing. I'll present you the new head of security. Following Pano's disgraceful dismissal. I'm ordering you to tie your security measures to protect our facility. I have a feeling that Panic and Knife and Terrorists will prevent to launch attack very soon. They will probably have a well armed team. Strong degenerate brutes who will use any dairy terrorist tricks they can think of. Be prepared to report anything unusual directly to me, understood. Oop, oop. Seeing something. 
There's the thing. We could go through this door here. Or we could technically just go through those vents, though. Totally go through those vents. Could I sneak through here? Ah, I can totally sneak through here. Nope, you didn't see a thing. I'm no longer here. I'm... Totally hidden. I don't like that light. I'm almost tempted to shoot that light. That did not work. Nothing. <laughs> Dead by right now, so. Oh, yeah, no, it's probably not. One more still patrolling. Hmm. Make my pistol better. I'm all for making my pistol better, you know. So that Yuggins note. October fast in fight. This October we'll be preparing a very special feast for everyone. We will have games, beer, great German food, and traditional German folk music band playing live on stage. Should be something to take a mind off the recent tour stirred by the terrace in the city. You may bring one family member to the party, and please, how I say, be fun as it's Thursday end of the day. I swear there has to be stuff in that one area, though. Has to be. Well, there could be in a hill. Nope, not seeing code. I don't think I'm seeing over it now. Well, let me just check. There's a note. Ensuring why curfew is still in effect. Following the recent terrorist attacks, the curfew placement citizen and the medical terrorists will be in effect for the foreseeable future to ensure the safety of all citizens. In the fight to protect the virus that we hold DO demands a strong prison and iron will program the per terror price speech yesterday after a major terrorist bombing attempt. Talking at middle school for medical children was prevented in the last minute. These anarchists across the Camera communist or a degenerate beast and we caught a defined by the righteous might of our brave warriors, he continued, adding that the destiny of the Reich is divine and unquestionable. Like seriously, if there was a goat, I'd say it'd be in hell, you know. Hmm. 
Well, there was a, literally anything in hell. I mean, there was a freaking mine in hell. Hey, look, gold. The problem though is it's like a gold bottle. It's not actually gold thing. And when we just, I was like, we've seen these things already, so there's not anything new really yet. Okay, well we found most of the gold, so let's just get going then. From drunken midnight beach walks in Sao Paulo to skulking through Nazi Tossa Central, I wondered if I was up to par after all these years. Männer, seid heute besonders wachsam. Ich hatte eine ziemlich schlimme Vorahnung. Man könnte sagen, sie kam mir im Traum. Und wo sind mein Tee und mein Schinkenbrötchen? Herr Gott noch mal! Can't have his face me or not. Please don't turn around. <coughs> Stealth, we need to get more headshots, so many headshots. Knives, commando. Kind of sounds like he's even right, but yeah, he's probably right, but. That scream, and no one reacts to that scream. Oh, fucking robot. Can you stop turning and look at me? Complicating shit. Fuck you, robot. Fuck you with your heavy armor. Do I sneak up and take it off? Oh, though, it's shit's complicated, yo. I could smell the sickly sweet perfume he'd chosen this morning. So I'm actually going the right way. I don't want to go the right way just yet. Hi. You stay over there. Ah! 
years of boozing had left a mark. Oh, I thought I, sh I shot him in the head and he just shrugged it off. So he's the one with the signal. Robots. Yeah, I'm gonna go down and check for gold. I doubt they could save me from hell, but yeah. Hunter, I know you've been waiting a long time for a promotion. You were deaf in an admiral application of enhanced interrogation techniques has helped us immensely during the years. Believe me, people are taking notes. That's why I send you an invitation to join me as my second command to oversee the important space exploration, uh, expansion for operations we're doing here on the moon. Typing loose ends they have out back on Earth. And your space now is my own. Glory to the right. Space. Can't consume that for overcharge? Yeah, I can consume that. Just saying, he gold. One gold left, could be in his office. It could be in his office. That is a possibility. But just saying, there's all these desks here. It's so possible it could be in one of these desks. I could seriously just be one. One of those deaths, this last one. It'll be so easy for me to miss. That's the problem. I'm trying to be thorough. Freaking heavy up there. Just concerning it. And robot. F you robot. You don't make my stealth a lot more complicated. So yeah, I think this one would just go with a stealthy way. That one's a heavy, entirely way too armored. We should just pew. I don't even think I could take down heavies. So I'm saying we'll do it this way. I could smell the sickly sweet perfume he'd chosen this morning. Agentin Silent Death nennen zu mir, als ich im Bett lag. Ich war wie gelähmt, konnte mich nicht bewegen. Sie kam an mein Bett, holte ein langes, scharfes Messer raus und okay. hielt es mir an die Kehle. Dann That's sagte sie, ihre Zeit ist um Hans. Und dann ähm, schnitt sie mir die Kehle durch. Einfach so. Furchtbar. Es wirkte so real. Was, wenn es eine Vision war, General Dunkel? Was, wenn sie mich wirklich töten will? Ich weiß. Ja. Sehr verrückt. Tut mir leid. Natürlich. Ja. Why don't you just like stand up? Sound like. Natürlich. Ja. Ja, Herr General. Mhm. No reaction now, I mean, even. Well, fine. Oh! Oh! 
years of boozing had left a mark. Eindringling, Eindringling, verteidigen Sie das Büro von Überkommandant Hans um jeden Preis. Ich wiederhole, verteidigen Sie das Büro von Überkommandant Hans oh, um okay. jeden this Preis. Hallo, das ist Das ist still just instant aggro on me. Man, that's some hard aggro. Like, fuck that. That's the guy who's always looking for my shit. Then decided to sit on the couch instead. Oh no, is oh no, is this whole you know? I sh do not him. He just shrugged it off. I could smell the sickly sweet perfume he'd chosen this morning. General Dunkel, ich muss Ihnen von dem Traum erzählen, den ich neulich hatte. Erinnern Sie sich an diesen britischen Agenten, den wir bei Kriegsende getötet haben? Den, den wir mit Lorenzes Hilfe geschnappt haben? Jedenfalls, in dem Traum kam seine Frau, die Sie Agentin Silent Death nennen, zu mir, als ich im Bett lag. Ich war wie gelähmt, konnte mich nicht bewegen. Sie kam an mein Bett, holte ein. Hello from General John Collect from my spirit in these trying times, but my story from the dreams have been having played vivid, friendly, real dreams. One of them trips flies back to the career the Caribbean. Bunk crow was trapped inside the interrogation room of Jack Lowent, but he was not tied to his chair this time. He said he was the other way around. He had pale pliers and was pulling out my teeth one by one. What horrible dreams would come next, I wonder. It's right in business messing around my head. How long do I have to live in fear of these terrorist monsters? Ein langes, scharfes Messer raus und hielt es mir an die Kehle. Dann sagte sie, ihre Zeit ist um Hans. Und dann ähm, schnitt sie mir die Kehle durch. Einfach so. There it is, finally. I do that the entire time, but it's like, no, you can't do that. I can't hide on his desk. I, heard like, I would assume the gold would be up here with him, you know? That's what I would assume. Um, shit. I'm behind a chair, you can't see me. Oh shit. I can't really do shit against the heavy though. I can't really do much against the heavy. Wait, what? There we go. So what should I do about you? Don't know.
I guess we do that. Okay, anyway. Go. So where's my freaking gold? So yeah, just escape. But they want me to leave the window. So all I had to do was just go out the window and not fight my way back out. Oh, that's cute. But where the fuck's the last goat? Like, I there's like it should be here somewhere, don't you think? Like, that's where I would have said, somewhere in his office. That's where I would have kept the goat. But I'm not seeing any goat, so... Huh. Hmm. Weird. Uh, that's a lot of health. Oh, it's just right out of hill. Then then we started stabbing. Okay, well that was easy enough. And then the way we go. Oh. Yeah, like and that. so another Nazi bell end had been sent to hell. Good riddance, Uber Commander Hans. I could feel the tug of war inside. A craving to escape this dreadful reality. But I couldn't. Not until each and every one of these Nazis was six feet under. Until my Jack was avenged. Next up, the man who betrayed Jack. Actor, filmmaker, and Nazi collaborator Chuck Lorenz. Once an undercover agent for the OSA, now a stooge for the Reich. Like so many American traitors, that snake was generously rewarded for collaborating with the Nazis and had been promoted to head producer of American propaganda. Lorenz was now a powerful man with powerful friends. Well, this powerful man was about to have a rendezvous with Agent Silent Death. So now we're basically the demo web. So this was Paragon Studios, mouthpiece for Nazi America, doling out rubbish propaganda to the masses. So enter the Paragon building. Is it simple to just walk up hill and in? No. <laughs> Not that simple. Why would it be that simple? Ah, uh, but we can crawl on these. I can probably hear him. I don't like the fact that it looks like the gold bottle. It makes it harder for me to uh, sort out. I got all the... I got all the readables last time, last time too. Cool. Okay, at least we got the gold though, from outside. As far as there's two of them. <gasps> what? Spotted the glass-domed main offices draped in Nazi banners beyond the sound stages. Shit. That's like where my target my would be. Going out on stage seems like a bad idea. Going behind stage seems like a good idea. Guards, this is Charles Lorentz speaking. As you know, I have a very important shoot coming up. 
Oh, there we now, go. with the horrible murder of my friend Uber Commandant Hans Stieglitz, I want everyone to keep their ears open and eyes peeled, all right? Do want any degenerate terrorist sneaking around on the premises. Well, that would be us, the degenerate terrorists sneaking around on the premises. What if we went uphill? Not really seeing anyone around. <laughs> German or Alps. Well, again, I'm sure we ask them to speak, say words of German, basking in the American audience. Well, maybe not the American audience. Two people can you say everything in German, or they die. Sounds like something they would do. Finally, I can't break. So we not. Uh, so yeah, I don't see any where potential gold could be here. So hopefully we're good. Hopefully I could just move on. Move on. But first thing I have to make sure. Yeah, it seems like if I don't have to worry, worry about this one, hopefully I could just go. The net set. That would be that would be decent. And it's a path yeah. too. But the guy was. Just go. Guards, guards, it's true. Again, I have told you countless times no one is allowed to disturb me when I'm in the zone. Acting requires perfect concentration, and you are ruining the preparations of my upcoming immaculate performance with your constant idiotic interruptions of flimsy requests and complaints. Thank you. Second goad. Nice. <coughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> Please don't turn around. Oh shit. What the Stop. 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 I shot you in the head. I shot you in the... Well, that's not good. Oh, jeez. Well, this is Escalade. Again, I have told you countless times, no one is allowed to disturb me when I'm in the zone. 
Acting requires perfect concentration, and you are ruining the preparations of my upcoming immaculate performance with your constant idiotic interruptions of flimsy requests and complaints. Thank you. Guards, guards, it's Charles the Ritz again. I have told you countless times, no one is allowed to disturb me when I'm in the zone. Why is allowed to disturb me when I'm in the zone? It's my zone. That's coming a lot easier than way that. Acting requires perfect concentration, and you are ruining the preparations of my upcoming immaculate performance with your constant idiotic interruptions of flimsy requests and complaints. Thank you. Oh, uh, got that, don't worry about that, you. Okay, I think we've been told enough food. Well, you don't really... <coughs> Need over to The Paragon Studios office building looked exactly like the place a wanker like Lorenz would fester. Everyone, the upcoming shoot for the new movie Blitzbench Returns, Vengeance for the Aryan Race, has a guard role available due to sudden illness. The part involves no talking. Ooh, thank. So, Chris, are you there? So that your game show contestants was horrible. That didn't kind of charisma there, kind of niche with artists. The guy with the yellow show looked like a dead fish on TV. The one with the uh, list sounded like she was choking a duck. We don't know if you find you. We should drop you more effort, please. You should keep your job. And there will be free knockwurst. Now, since I'm sure there will be many Not volunteers, first. please form an orderly line outside my office later today at 7 p.m. This looks like that's not the part where the demo was. Starred around here. So we got two gold things. I was assuming that wouldn't be any about here. But yeah, just consume, 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 consume. Consume, 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 consume. Flash that one nice. Oh, is that not gold? Nope, that's not gold. Just to spite me. It's in the same shape as one would. Two. Ah. So then. Uh, okay. Now we get into what the demo took place. Don't think I remember the dog. Headshot. Stab. That's a shotgun. Or shock hammer, I should say. Oh, 
Well, my knives didn't work. You have a drinking problem, bartender in Sao Paulo once said. <laughs> Bloody Nazis are marching on your streets and you're telling me? <laughs> John Zephyrs. Okay, I'll be doing all rehearsals in the placement movie in the dome room. Please sign us, just go to the dome room entrance. I may fans, you probably want to get my autograph for still or lock my hair, and I must not be disturbed when I prepare for such a I program. have a problem. The world had gone mental, and I just needed a drink. Maybe drinking wasn't the solution, but it sure soothed the pain. Look, what else was there? Apparently I can't go to that one. Anyway, I was a big girl, and I decided when I could drink. Mega Hitler. Bloody hell, Jessica. Stop obsessing about your drinking. Well, that's a thing. <laughs> Oh, there yeah, that bus is to distract me with that shadow. Our producer Charles Thomas is the new Blitzmensch. Over this year, we brought the pack of fish with an out new Blitzmensch movie adaptation made by Jenna Ingo's son, Adele Warder single. They will be released at the end of the following year. Today, it was announced that famed horror producer Charles the one should be producing and starring in the title in this ambitious production. I approach you again this opportunity, he said. Harold Lorenz is owned in an interview earlier today. Blitz Mintz has quickly become a household name among the citizens of American territories. To be able to uh, bring this classic here to life on the silver screen is incredible. Hey, and over to the Noble Over Gold. That one. I'm oh, just missing one. So isn't this for right here? Yeah, right here. That's different, because last time it was here was a file you had to go find for the demo with part. Is that what I think it is? That is what I think it is. Congrats, you now have a silencer for the machine. Pistol. I think I still want to use the pistol, though. Just because. I like the pistol. Makes me happy. It does pistoly things. So yeah. Now I go over here. And into the vents again. Hmm, two eh. Eh? Oh, Alright, right, and now here we are. Here is this place. Oh yeah, we had to go through this place too, didn't we? Didn't like this one. This one's entirely too dangerous. Don't seize me, by the way. It's entirely too bold. Yeah, we're gonna fail it. Shit, going through here, going through here. Going through the vent. Going through the vent. Going through the vent. What the? Oh! Ah! Oh! There we go. You know what sucks is there's probably gold down there on the that area. Probably bloody gold down there on that area. That's where I would go. Down in the dangerous freaking area. Not hell. Oh crap. Need to pick this up. 
Herr Lawrence, you should know the Uber Commandant Hans Stiglitz has been murdered. He was assassinated to in Sacramento. I suspect it could be someone from the past coming back to haunt us. Do you remember a British officer named Jack Barrett? He should, since it was you who set him up and allowed him to cap us to capture him during the war. If the work of his wife, Agent Silent Death, then you might be in mortal danger. Consider yourself warned. General Duncan. Ah, uh, frickin' heavies. Surprise. They're not freaking out about that. I was out of the most silent. Get to him? Yes, yes, I would. But firstly, firstly, so all basically right about that. Oh, I could go right about that way. First, check the stalls. Make sure there's no gold. Okay, so I want to go back. There is danger. Stupid. So we got here. I need to go check for gold. No. No. Is it very heavy on this floor too? You'd think. See, I would put the goat somewhere out here. They would force you to come all the way into the center area. Into the open. Stop sneaking so much. 
and then find the code. The problem though is I'm not seeing the code still. That seemed like a good idea too. Oh well. Yeah, not seeing it. Huh. I mean, that was the food items all the hell. The goat's not with them. So where the hell is the goat at? On the ground floor, right? Yeah. I don't know what the hell we're having to see. Huh. I don't want to miss it, so I think I'll just check the stupid internet. Because we're so close, we might as well make sure I know where it is. Ah, yeah, it's Captain Wilkins. That's a uh, one of one. Okay, so we are on volume two. The last girl for us is on the desk in your target's office. Well, that's all I need to know. I somehow I thought that, but I had to make sure. I had to make sure. Okay. okay they might be back. Shit, which way's forward then? Okay, that was my fault. Yeah. Okay, do 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 Just go this way, too. And not go through the bathroom vent. Because the bathroom vent would go there, but this would also go here. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Akun, I am Blitzmensch. Prepare to be blitzed? Well, that sounds awkward, doesn't it? I thought it was fine, sir. Are you a movie critic, Sebastian? No? Then shut the hell up! Let's see. Achtung, I am... That's not... Prepare, oh, Jesus Christ, it feels like I've eaten glue or something. Who, who wrote this baloney? General Engel's oldest son, Adalvados, I think, sir. Of course. I mean, the man's a genius. It's pretty darn good, don't you think? I thought you said Shut up and listen, Sebastian. Thank you. Sends him a proper. I think I found it. Prepare to be blitz. God damn it to hell. Achtung, I am Blitzbench. Prepare to be blitz. Prepare to be blitz. That guy right there is going to be a problem. What do I do about him? Ah! 
well, at least he went down easier than the other guy did with throwing knives. Uh, I won't call that a quick commander kill. The alarm was already sounded, I'm pretty sure. So, before we escape, oh, it's just sitting there on his desk. Oh, imagine that. Now well, he's got that. I just remind you today of what transpired at the end of the war. Jack Fowler uh, considered me a friend, put his faith in me, and I always remember the look on his face when I betrayed him. Not because I feel guilty about it, because he gave me a fifth and four I could accomplish the greatness that I could achieve. I just put my mind into it. Betraying Jack gave me a way into the absolute cream of the crop of the new American order. Gave me a chance to live out my dreams as a movie producer and as an actor. Interesting that such a single decision could shift the rest of your life. Never forget this, Chuck. The power is all that matters. The will to power is all that matters. Well, there you go. And we got the last goat. So, technically, we can leave. We miss... Quite a few of the early documents, apparently. Oh, well. Moving on. I'd planned on spending the end of my days in Brazil. I was at the point where it seemed my years of strife were finally over. Jack was fading away into the distant past, obscured by the spirits medicating my soul. I should have realized that's not how life works. And now it came down to this. General Dunkel, the man who killed my Jack. The coward had long ago decided to hide away on the moon. General Dunkel would be my last hit. Then I could go back to my old life and never return. Jack always said he was over the moon whenever something good happened. Well, my love, how I wish you were here. Oh, yeah, Moonbase Gamma was the loathsome General Dunkel's domain, a military research complex. Yeah. It was just a matter of time before someone discovered the bodies in the transport, so I had to move fast. So now we're on the moon. Well, in the moon transport. Well, that's a thing. Moving on. Still need more gold. Weapons. Need more science takedowns, need more headshots, need more quick commander kills. And let's move. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You know, as I said, gold. Uh, you know, I'll make sure we check. Making sure we check. Making sure there's no gold hidden at the very start that I could easily miss and regret. I could blow myself up. That seems counterproductive, so. Schnell, hallo. Bringen Sie Herrn Schmidt zu General Dunkel. Er ist ein wichtiger Gast und verdient den besten Empfang. Herr Schmidt won't be making it to the meeting, boys. that? Nope. Uh, I'm going still. That thing though, I don't think I can just tag out still. And ponds it out. It's a bit above my pay grade. Actually, more like a lob of a pig, right? But still. Hey, we got a map. Well, no, is before we go forward. Oh, <laughs> never mind. I was going to say, I would put the gold near the pound around, but. 
No, apparently it's so stupid to go towards the pond. That's awkward. <laughs> Bad. Okay, let's try that again. Oh. Let's say it after that. Eh? Well, that was awkward. Oh. Hmm, apparently that didn't work. As far as the heavy, though, too. Five pounds of hope. And such an there will be a scheduled test room of the life support system in the AO control center. Test room is designed to test the system's interior in case of emergency. Please avoid the AO controls in the time of before any lethal reaction is like last year. Okay. Oh, where's that part? I don't know where patrol rooms. Can I crawl under this? Oh, that's okay. So much better, please. I am sorry. This way. And now I'll sneak into this. Crawl my way around. Crawl my way around. Down. <coughs> Shit. Why not? Try to get under this, but it won't let me get under this one. You people get what you deserve or something like that. I think it's happening. I wish I could go under this, though. Then go down the section. Okay. It was time for more extreme measures. Well, that's not 
can't even move dead. Then we're dead again. Well, this is unfortunate because my save states in the state where we'll basically we're just going to be in the jungle and have things. Well, crawl under there, crawl under there, why aren't you crawling under there? Haha, -ha. you won't get me now. Haha. Ah, you won't kill me now. Nope, nope, I'm hidden. Tell you won't be able to get me. Oh shit, hi. Ah. These rooms of Han said a steward of things for the past moment. So what happened to the night check? I ate in that room where his fire rest place. Check now with one spade mercy. No matter what torture my for his hands put him through. Never tried to sell so in exchange for his life. Why is that? Why couldn't he grab me this and then? And why can't I stop thinking about him? It's so long after all to this. One of, them, of all the hundreds of rabbit darts I've put down since. Maybe the reason why I can't let him cover is that it doesn't feel complete. His wife is still there, mocking me from the showers. If she comes here, maybe I finally get a chance to put an end to this. Husband, and I suppose I am to be your crowning achievement? I think not terrorist. <laughs> maybe he was right. Maybe I was finally in over my head. Maybe Jack would never be avenged. Well, at least I'd die trying.
Share on the live support system that makes Moon Page Cameron a habitable. Has a page of weak spot. It requires an enormous amount of cooling, and the system providing the cooling is made up of very old parts that we need to replace. Two cooling, cooling coils with the power of the cooling system break down. We would throw them into the life support system and end up all alive on that one. So, we're going to do something stupid. That's a different one. Oh shit, we missed it. We missed it. No. We don't have to Oh, that's easy. Easy part. Where's my last go, Dad? Warnung, Sauerstoffniveau bei 80 Prozent. Last go. Warnung, Sauerstoffniveau bei 50 Prozent.
Warnung, Zirkulationssysteme im Sektor deaktiviert. Luftdruck fällt. Warnung, Sauerstoffniveau fällt. Warnung, sofort evakuieren. Warnung, sofort evakuieren. Halten Sie sich an die Protokolle. Evakuieren Sie den General zuerst. Warnung, Sauerstoff auf die Fähre niedrigem Niveau. Warnung, evakuieren Leute. That's a great. That's a great idea. Just okay. Fun out for that first time last go. up again but fuck's sakes I'm trying to never there and ugh okay let's look this up real quick this one's a tough one to find after using the terms of control room too and uh, like the self door to new and go into a new hallway by a crawl space right across squeeze inside the right just about one more code class what the fuck uh Find a crawl space, basically. That's all I can establish from that. Crawl space, crawl space. I'm not even seeing any crawl space. Okay. Let's find out where's my map. Probably want me to go all the way back there, which means crawl space. Maybe there. Maybe there. Okay. Wow, how would I even stop? That didn't even look like a crawl space to me. Okay, well, at least we got all the gold. That did not even look like a crawl space to me. Are you in the pan? Maybe not. As I stood over Jack's bane, a sense of emptiness overcame me. The deed was done, and yet the hole in my heart would not fully heal. I watched a million stars sparkling in the void. Earth looked so serene from up above. How charming a con man was distance. And so I returned to my old life in Brazil, determined to end my days in oblivion. It wasn't a bad way to go, all things considered. But something had changed. That empty feeling remained, and no liquor could fill its void. Then one day, another letter came, signed by the enigmatic Crimson Bulldog. The American Revolution was in full force, and the Resistance needed me. I understood in that moment what the emptiness meant. This wasn't just about avenging Jack. No. This was bigger than me. So I traveled back to America to fight the Nazis once again. Maybe I was heading towards certain death. But Agent Silent Death would not go quietly into the night. I don't 
to the Lytra story. This then they went and went hunt down these ones, got our revenge, and then everything, and then it didn't really help. Because revenge doesn't really help. We still felt empty. But we went and hunted more Nazis, so. Oh well. What's the fucking Venus in the one? So, where the hell is. Oh, it. What did. What's his face in the base we back there too? Like, wouldn't he end up there because he his thing was about the you know, the sunray. And the sunray's on Venus, so wouldn't he also end up there? But that's also where oh, Joe ended up? Huh. Anyway we'll check out his thing next time. Huzzah! And a reminder, Anna still wants to talk to you. But you keep doing other things instead. So now we'll check out the next chronicle. Well, next time. Hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all and have a nice day. I definitely like that. The whole stealth. Except for then when you get spied. Oh god, are you squishy. Super squishy.